I was out doing some yard work very late in the evening just before the sun set, and a little movement by one of our flower beds caught my eye. It was this little decays brown snake, and they're nocturnal, so you don't see them very often, and I've only seen a couple of them in my lifetime. Since they are such a rare sight, I wanted to get some video and a couple of photos of it. So I offered it some water just to see if it needed some. Then I turned off the camera and went outside to get an earthworm. I don't know if it ever got a drink, but it was hungry and it went for the earthworm right off the bat. These little snakes rarely get over 12 inches in length, and both of the ones that I've seen were more like 8 inches. And they feed almost exclusively on earthworms, slugs, and snails. They have specially adapted teeth that allow them to pull the snail out of its shell and then eat it. Since snails and slugs can be a real problem if you're a gardener, having one of these little snakes around your garden is a really good thing. After it finished its meal, I put the lid back on the aquarium and it spent the night indoors and then I released it the next evening. I waited till late evening and then I released it in a place I thought it would be safe till dark. It's over by our compost pile and there was plenty of places to hide. And I just let it get up on my hand and climb off when it was ready and go on about its way. Like garter snakes and water snakes, decays brown snakes give birth to live young rather than lay eggs. If you've ever seen one of these little snakes, let us know about it down in the comments. And if you're just now finding this channel, please subscribe. We'll see you next time.